everyone this is la what up with ya i need to see what's going on with my we going down to the torres what's going on what's the present situation this week and the past situation present situation and the future of this week excuse me and I want to say hello to everyone. And how is y'all doing? Are y'all ready to spend some time with me? I'm ready for y'all. And I want to let you know I care about you. You Tauruses. Hey. I got love for you. So do me a favor at the end of this video. Would y'all please push the dial. Okay. Like, share, and subscribe. I really appreciate it. Let's get this rock and loading. What's going on with Tauruses this week, Spirit? What's going on with Tauruses? It's this week, Spirit. What's going on with Tauruses? And bless this culture. Okay, what's going on with Tauruses this week, Spirit? What is they going to be going through this week? What's going on? What's the present situation with Taurus? We'll start with that first. What's the present situation with Taurus this week, Spirit? Okay, we have the Six of Coins in the reverse. Okay, what is the uh, present situation with Taurus this week, Spirit? What is the present situation with Taurus this week? We have the Knight of Coins in the reverse. What is the future situation for my Taurus this week? What's going on in the future for us this week's? Okay, we have the Ten of Wands. And then what is the outcome of the situation this week? What is the whole outcome of this week? Um, we have the Three of Swords is the outcome. Okay, let's see. On the Six of Coins, we have basically um, some jealousy going on. Okay, some envy and some unpaid loans some of you Tauruses. And some of y'all are very ungiving of oneself this week. You're not feeling you got bad debts, you know, unpaid things, you know, and uh, some of you acting selfish this week. Why, I don't know. But you just ain't giving this week, Taurus. You're not really giving much in your situation. What else? What is the deal with the Six of Coins? Why? What's going on with that in the present situation? What's going on in the present situation for my Taurus? Why is they not giving? What's going on with this spirit? What's going on with this? Okay. Hold on. It fell down. Just a minute, y'all. Okay. We got the King of Swords in the reverse. Basically, there is some selfishness and there's a cruelty and a person that's a dangerous and wicked person, one who causes sadness. Somebody around you is very, conf they love conflict and they've got a lot of cruelty towards you. So you're not willing to give to this person because this person is just a taker. They just want your money, Taurus, and they take and they're selfish and they're just selfish. They're really all for themselves. Okay? And you're not willing to give up your money. Aha. Don't blame me this week. What is the present situation? You got the knight of coins in the reverse. Stagnation. And some carelessness and lack of determination direction. This week. Some of you are not very term determined this week. What's going on? Why is the knight of coins? Why are they feeling like that this week? Why is they not determined this week? <laughs> My Tauruses. Well, they got the Wheel of Fortune in the upright. Some of you need to, uh, there's an end to something. Uh, there's an unexpected, something happens this week. Uh, fate. That could be um, advancement or better or worse. It's a combination of things could happen in this situation. So you're basically just sitting up here waiting for your wheel to turn to your side. <laughs> I understand that. And in the future things that's going on this week, you have the Ten of Wands. You're just feeling overburdened, Taurus. You feel like 
there's excessive pressures going on, problems that, you know, need to be soon solved because you ain't finna deal with them long. Possible using power for selfish ends. Some of people are against you. Um, that you're trying to meet goals. You know, you own, you, you're you really trying to meet goals, but there's things that are just, just pissing you to make you want to, frankly, go to the toilet. Head to the toilet. That's the best way to put it. Okay? Because that's how you feel about it. But the outcome of the week is the three of swords. There could be some separation and uh, some sorrow and some grief because of someone being absent in your life. You may feel unhappiness. And just because of that, you feel bad. <laughs> Why is the sorrow? Why is the three of swords here, spirit? Why is it the outcome? Why is three of swords at the outcome? Look like it could be a separation or something going on here. Why is the outcome somebody leaving you towards alone? Why is the sorrow three of swords here? Why is the three of swords here? Don't want to tell me. Why is the three of swords here, spirit? Why is the three of swords here? Okay. The seven of wands in the reverse. Because, and this is going to cause you a lot of anxiety, some embarrassment, and some kind of losses because of losing in the, you feel like you're in combat with somebody and you're not backing down. You says, I'm not backing down. I don't know what the heck is wrong with them, but I'm not doing it. I'm just no, no, no this week. I'm going to stand my ground. This week, I'm going to stand my ground to things. You know, and it's okay. You know, everybody got their moments. Okay, Spirit. Can I have some more details on this spread? What else is going to be going down with this spread this week? Anything else that needs to be told to my cool Tauruses with their lovely selves? Y'all not taking no crap this week. You're tired of people penny pinching. And you don't feel like you want to give. Because they penny pinching off of you. And you ain't ready for it. What else is going on with my Tauruses this week, Spirit? What else, Spirit? Okay. Yep. There it go. Trickery. Somebody trying to trick you, Taurus. That, that you ain't, you ain't, but you ain't falling for it. Trickery. You're not falling for, well, well, let me see. Let me put an example. Well, I need this, and I need your help. But then, they get ghosts once you get it and come back. Don't come back. Get what they want and come back. Trickery. Somebody's trying to trick you right now in your life. you got some trickery going on. Can't say the other word, would. What else going on, Spirit, this week? Somebody's trying to do some trickery and play with your mind a little bit this week. What else, Spirit? What else is going on this week for my my tourists that they need to be aware about? Okay. Somebody, mysticism, somebody is watching you behind the scenes. You got a peeper. Taurus, you got a peeper watching you. You know, watching what you do, what you say. They is peeping on you. You got a peeper. You know, but as you say, let them peep. Because you're trying to be a workaholic this week. You're trying to make your change. You ain't worried about that. You're not worried about that at all. So you figure if they peeping, go with you. Go with you. But the only thing, somebody this week, completion, has come to a stop. Something unexpected may happen this week. When I see this card, some people think, that a completion is an end, but sometimes a person has done their time, Taurus, and they're going home. Sometimes a completion is the end of a relationship or just, just leaving things behind because you're done with it. You're tired of it. You know, but there's, why is the completion part here for Taurus? Okay. Why is the complete completion here for Taurus spirit? Because somebody is playing victim. Somebody wants to be the victim. They playing victim on you this week. They're getting sad. 
oh, I can't do this and I can't do that. Taurus, they're trying to make some confusion in your life. They want you to be very confused this week. They will, cause they they want that money. Okay, they are living in a dream state. You know, they figure you should be helping them regardless of what you're doing. But you need to have faith in the situation. You need to keep your faith at all times. Listen to the man upstairs and listen to your instincts, cause it's telling you something. One more card for Taurus. What else you got to say to Taurus this week, Spirit? Anything else that need to be said for Taurus this week? What else need to be said for Taurus this week? Anything else, Spirit? Okay. Some of you need to balance this stuff out. Balance your life out. Balance your love life. Balance everything out because it's all jacked up. You need some balance, Taurus, this week. So you need to worry on, start balancing your life out because, you know, life is short and you need to enjoy yourself and have joy in your life. Don't be worrying about what somebody trying to swindle you and trick you because that's everybody. You know, people getting, it's hard out in these streets. <laughs> but let me see what card they got for, what do you want to tell Taurus about this lover that's trying to trick them into doing what they want, this person that's trying to trick them. If it's not a lover, it's a friend. What do you want to tell them, Spirit, about this situation? About this trickster for Taurus this week? Uh-oh. That's too many. Okay, Spirit. What's, what else is on relationship this week? Okay. Um, there's some religion factors affecting your love life. Pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you, see? They want you to pay attention to this crap. Because somebody trying to swindle you, okay? Even they they telling you, listen to the red flags. You get trying, the person is trying to uh, play you, you know, play. And you need to stay optimistic about your love life. Just because this jerk don't work, there's always another, okay? Made one, they made another, okay? But anyway, that's your reading for my eh, 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 Taurus. So push the dial and let me know you said hi. That's for you this week. Keep your head up. Watch out for trickery. Don't let them do you. Push that dial. Subscribe. Be on my side. Love y'all, Taurus. Bye-bye.